police suffered burns in a fire at his home on Aldridge Street in West Warwick. Police say the victim lives alone on a small farm where he has lived for about 40 years. He was treated at Kent County Hospital and released. A Florida man who was delivering a truckload of scallops to Boston had an experience. Yesterday when a kerosene stove exploded in his home. Police say Carl Lovin was in the kitchen when the stove blew up. He ran across the street to a neighbor's house to get help. It took firefighters about three quarters of an hour to put out the flames. Police say the house had no running water or electricity. Lovin, who suffered burns of the face and upper body, was treated at Kent County Memorial Hospital and later released. The Coast Guard today... Or ...late yesterday afternoon. The man suffered first and second degree burns to his face. A house fire, you might think, is a personal tragedy for the victim. But Carl Levin doesn't look at it that way. As Newswatch 10's Pat Masters tells us, there are lots of things Carl Levin sees differently. When Carl Levin's kerosene stove exploded yesterday, he had to act quickly. He had his animals to think about. Levin ran to use a neighbor's phone to call the fire department. But things were pretty much back to normal here today. After all, there's work to be done on any farm, however small. There were the 20 chickens to feed, the 30 rabbits, and the geese to think about. His biggest concern was the two new litters of kittens, only three and four days old. He couldn't save one mother and two kittens. The rest went to a neighbor. He gave his two dogs to another neighbor for a while. He's upset that his coats got all wet. His windows busted. And the first and second degree burns on his face are certainly an annoyance. I didn't feel bad. I felt all right. Only the face burnt, that's all. This is where Lovin has lived alone for 60 years. In the middle of a residential neighborhood, he has no heating, no plumbing. An outhouse does just fine. Do you think of yourself as a, a, a recluse or a loner? I used to go out with all kind of women one time. But three of them balled me up, so I cut it out. You don't keep a man like Mr. Lovin down. His animals are his main concern. Lovin says he will stay with his sister till the farm gets fixed up. Pat Masters, Newswatch 10, West Warwick.